You came from Gettysburg? Am I right about that? Mm -hmm. All right, so the Civil War is fresh in your mind, right? Mm -hmm. This is a tiny little scene of Appomattox. Feel free to come closer or maybe you know, take a look and then let someone else come in. It is a challenge sometimes to work with these much smaller paintings. This is the scene of the surrender. Grant and Lee are meeting um, in order to officially end the war, although of course it wouldn't exactly end right at this moment. How has the artist chosen to present the scene? If you're all the way over here, feel free to come in and fill in the front. You can tell who won. So is it the poses? You can tell who won. That's very interesting. Can. How can you tell who won? <laughs> well, because the Union soldier's in the front, and he's got his hand on the desk, and he's kind of his whole chest is facing out towards the audience, uh -huh. and it's kind of like it's almost like a teacher stance to somebody. You're scolding the <laughs> child. I mean, that's kind of look at it. It's like I can't believe you just did this, and that's what he's doing because mm -hmm. Lee was such a highly regarded. Mm -hmm. officer in the military at the time it's it's almost like he's looking at like why did you do this to yourself and mm. to us and kind of like he's getting scolded okay what about lee though he's not exactly cowering in a corner how does the artist show him show this highly respected regarded man in this sort of tough moment to me it's like when he's got his hands like I, I, I can't believe i had to do this mm -hmm. that it came that so it's very close. hard for him to do this what else do you notice about the scene you got light right in the yeah. middle. Mm -hmm. So that, I don't know if that means like the light, the focus is the middle where they're green. Maybe to quit fighting. That is maybe the highlight of the moment where the, the two sides are coming together. Yeah. And let's use that to talk about composition. It is two sides, right? Mm -hmm. The uniforms. How are those two sides equal? Are they? Mm -hmm. In fact, there, we got three soldiers on one end and two soldiers on the other end. Okay. So it's a little bit more weight over here. Even if you just look at the height of the two generals, it's roughly equal, um, the way they're presented. You're right that Grant is slightly forward in that sort of authority stance. Uh, but if you look into surrender orders, the fact that Lee was allowed to keep his sword is a huge step. Um, what does this say about what the North was hoping for the end of the war, the way that the scene is presented in terms of a surrender. How did they want to treat the South now that everything was over? In this moment, it looks like they just wanna, okay, it's like brothers fighting, done, yeah. over, mm -hmm. let's go back to the way things were, let's forget about it. Mm -hmm. now, of course, we're history teachers, we know that doesn't actually happen. Right. Yeah, but when you look at this guy's post, it's not really like, you know, yeah. hey, I, I really don't care about this, you know? Mm -hmm. Grant wasn't wearing his general bars. Mm -mm. He, a few things are historically accurate. We know that he had mud um, on his paint. He, was, he rushed there on his right, horse. Right, yeah, so, and he yes. borrowed a jacket, so he wasn't wearing his general's right. jacket. Right, yeah. but he wasn't wearing his general's jacket. So anytime you see an inaccuracy, something you know it's actually wrong from the way it happened. For me, that's actually the most valuable part of an artwork because that's pointing out a decision that the artist made in order to help tell the story. Washington crossing the Delaware. Exactly, exactly. Um, so actually, if we read the accounts of this scene, and there are many of them, there were a ton of people in this room. So why might the artist have chosen just to show a few? Make it more intimate. Make it more intimate? Any other? How does that help tell the story? He had to illustrate the significance of the famous Lee having to surrender, which ultimately became the turning point in the war. Okay. So it highlights him more if there are fewer people in the room. Okay. 